By default, the Fit plugin will take uh, your product's title, description, um, and URL and use them into the feed. So uh, this is the data that the product catalog will get. But you have the option to use custom titles, custom descriptions, and even a custom URL just for uh, the product catalog. Edit a product. Go on the product catalog options. And you have these dedicated fields. You can add a custom title, a custom description, and if you want a custom URL. This, is, this will be the URL that um, Facebook will have. So when someone clicks on, on, uh, on the product on Facebook, they will land on this specific URL if you have one. Otherwise, it will be just a normal URL. Now, once you add the custom title, custom description, and the custom URL if you want to, you need to go and uh, edit an existing feed or when you create uh, a new feed, there are some extra settings. You can check these. The, this option right here, use custom titles and use custom descriptions. Now, if a product has custom title, uh, it will be uh, the product title in the feed. If there isn't a custom title, we will use the normal um, WooCommerce title. Same thing with description. If there is a custom description, we will use it. If there is no custom description at all. We will go to the next option, short description. If there is no short description, we will um, uh, look for the description. And if the product doesn't have a description at all, no custom description, no short description, no uh, description, we will use the product title. This makes sure that the product is not rejected by Facebook because products with no description will be rejected. Uh, if you don't want this to happen, you can just uncheck uh, the, the backup solution, the product title. Anyway, once you check this and you update, the feed will have custom, product, uh, custom um, titles and custom descriptions. 